So. Good morning. We thought we were at the top of our climb, but we all know we have 1,800 feet today. Our climb from this beautiful place after a good breakfast. Um, so we go up a little further to the top of San, San Bernardino Pass, and then we start going down, down, down. We could go probably all the way down 4,000 feet, but we're stopping at about 2,000 feet down the mountain to stay at a town called Andears, A-N-D-E-R-S. We have thermal bites, thermal bites, thermal baths, so maybe we'll try that this evening. Um, oh, I'm, I think no. I'm done. No, no, <laughs> no gracias. <laughs> um, Oh, so Susan let me say that on the way up the Alp, <clears throat> I split it into three, really four different climbs and had a hotel at the end of each day so that um, well, we wouldn't be killing ourselves and we wouldn't have to look for a camping spot and we wouldn't have to set up a tent and we wouldn't have to wash dishes and we wouldn't have to cook, mainly my sweet wife. <laughs> so anyway, she says I'm a genius for that. Yes. Anyway, thanks for following. Thank you to Hotel San Bernardino. San, tell you say it. Okay. Thank you, <laughs> Hotel San Bernardino Lido. <laughs> that was awesome. Y'all should come stay. Good morning. Leaving Restaurant Del Lido. And I'm pretty sure we go over that little ridge to our right. San Bernardino Pass. Here we come. Where's if somebody can tell me what that sign means. <laughs> I have no idea. Car up. Hill up. I'm staying a tent though because I don't want to fall off the cliffo. Cut it short because her uh, she's got mud and dirt. Yeah, because here in the town, the Bredo Sport is okay, but the other side is Splugen. Splugen, uh, the Sport, Splugen, Splugen Sport. Is, uh, close to okay, you pass uh, by the normal. Embarrassing to say, but we passed them in the town. He was at his house with it, walking his dog. Well, the town is way down there by that green, and he got here at the same time we did. I mean, he had a more direct route, but that's embarrassing. Somebody could tell me what that is. I have no idea. The little one and this bigger one. Run. I guess we still have a ways to go. I want you to those cars zigzag back and forth up there. Hi. 
Hey, Susie, there is a photo spot, one of those fish yeah. things. Are we going to do it? Hey, huh? nice. There we are. It's not that far, it's right there. Yep. And we have somebody to take our pictures. Yeah, yeah you have to. You, you have to. Yeah, you have to. A photo spot, too. I'm pretty sure we've knocked the crap out of this Alp. Ah, oh, yeah, we passed there. passed there. Yeah. Yes, we did in bikes. Yeah. Yes. Excellent. Excellent. Okay, so interestingly, my battery died. Can you believe that? So I uh, plugged it in because I wanted to come get a picture of the headwaters of the Rhine River as it flows down to Germany. Man, this is a little more fun. Okay, so it took us four days to climb up and about 10 minutes to come down. That's a little anticlimactic. Seriously. I'm gonna have to take a picture of this. So I guess, I guess we just started right up there but I should have come down in a hurry. Okay, we're in a valley. Alps are done. Oh man. And that's the entrance to the tunnel that goes through the mountain that people who don't want to go over the pass can take. Susie says, I don't want to go to Ozfart. Architecture has definitely changed. How you feeling? Good. Didn't, didn't eat too much? No. Tummy feels okay, legs okay? Yeah, yeah. Brakes okay, gears okay? Yeah. Okay. Okay, my little splurgeon. Topography has changed. Building techniques have changed, architecture. Mm. Still stunning. Those lifts. Looks like a food, like a restaurant right there. But we don't speak in the Deutsch. We're gonna have to up our game here, Susie. <laughs> In any language. That's one of So we're flying right alongside the autostrade the main highway. And it doesn't bother me a bit. Because we are flying.
try and go to Sprugeon to see if we can work on Susie's rear wheel. Uh, She's beating me up a hill. Hello, my good man. Would you happen to know the way to Splurgeon? Splurgeon. Splurgeon. Oh. Okay, ask your friend. Okay, I'll go ask him. Excuse me, my good man. Excuse me, yes. Oh, you've got a good one on the line there. Would you happen to know the way to Splurgeon? No, no. Hmm. Focused, are you? Oh, well, jolly good day. Should have camped here. Whew. <laughs> Bridge. No, this is his Bridge, and this is uh, the next city down. Next city down was called. Now it seems like when we start to hear the wind blow a little bit, that usually means that rains aren't too too far behind. down this out for a long time so I take back my sadness. Guys, yes. Brigands, Austria? Uh, yeah. 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 Yeah, so we started in Constance. Okay. Yes. And where do you go? Where's your Comas, uh, Lake, Lake of Comas. We went through there. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. Yes. Yes, are you camping? Campeggio? Yeah. Yes. Yes. This is this mineral bath place that we went to. We kind of thought it was going to be a thermal bath, like hot, but it was really like lukewarm water. So it was kind of fun, but uh, not great. <laughs> Darren really liked it. So it counted as a shower today. Bye. Happy six weeks. Happy six weeks. You're, you're done great. I'm not homesick yet. <laughs> uh,